Oakland Fire Battalion Chief Melinda Drayton is with us from the scene. Good morning, Chief. Good morning. Chief, let me ask you first, how is your community dealing with this uh, massive loss of life? Uh, the community is reeling. Uh, it's, um, it's been a really long weekend, a lot of raw emotion. Uh, everybody's still scrambling for information. There seems to be, you know, less than a few degrees of separation. Uh, in a city of over 400,000, everyone appears to know somebody that knows somebody. Um, it's, it feels very small town. You were inside the warehouse. Can you describe the scene? I guess yesterday when I, when I went into the building before we had started the recovery, um, it is a large warehouse space. And if you can imagine a roof, a second floor and a mezzanine all collapsing into the main floor with a huge amount of fire load and massive amount of stuff um, just on top of everything in small mounds and large mounds, in some cases reaching almost to the rooftop and in other areas you could see, you know, pathways through. Amidst all that, Chief, uh, can you Tell us about the status of the recovery effort and the challenge of it. Uh, we are challenged with making sure that we are not missing anything. Um, so it is an arduous, slow process. Once we move debris and determine that there is no body, we are able to move forward. And the minute we find a body, all operations stop until that body has been extricated and managed by the coroner's office and given the green light to continue with our rescue or recovery operation. Do you expect to find more bodies? Absolutely. Do you have any idea how many people were inside the building? No, we're getting conflicting reports. Um, we know that there was an original RSVP list of approximately 200. We have an, a report um, that's unconfirmed of just shy of 100 people in the building. And at this point, we still have members of our community that are unaccounted for and victims at our Family Resource Center still looking for loved ones. My best to all of you in your community there. Battalion Chief Melinda Drayton, thank you so much. Thank you. Good morning.